Alright guys, so as you just saw, that was my fish tank. I got some little tilapia in there. Anyway, hi. It's Mini Angling TV again with another video. Sorry, I don't know why I did my intro like that. But anyway, today's video, well tomorrow's video, because it's actually night right now. I just don't have a time tomorrow morning to shoot this whole thing for you guys. So I want to do it right now while I still have a bit of time. I'm actually going out with my girlfriend in a few minutes. And then tomorrow, we're going to be catching a pet bass for this fish tank. Hopefully we can catch one. I want to catch a small one. Um, I'm doing some pond hopping with a good friend, so I think it's going to be pretty fun and hopefully we can catch a little dink, put it in the tank, feed that thing, film it for you guys. I actually want to do some aquascaping as well. Um, this whole idea came from the YouTuber Banner Bass. He makes amazing videos. He's, he's called Tank Tuesday or something. He has two big bass in there, big bluegill. Now, the fish I have in here right now is tilapia. It's almost like a bluegill, but they keep the tank super clean. Like, I never have to clean the tank because they eat all the algae and all the filthy stuff that makes your tank filthy. So, if you have a fish tank and you want to keep it clean and you're struggling, get a little tilapia. Get a few of them. They really do clean it. Um, but anyway, guys, I'm going to go right now. Thanks a lot for watching this little intro. I'm going to get into the fishing in a few minutes. Um, anyway, guys, stay tuned. <music> Welcome back guys. Okay, we are at our first pond right now. Pond slash damn lake. Um, I'm here with Ian, my good friend. And we're going to be fishing a little bit of top water this morning. So I don't think we're going to get the pet bass here, but uh, we're going to do some pond hopping. So later on we'll go to a few different dams and hopefully we can catch a little small one to put in the, the big fish tank for you guys. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the little b-roll that just went. And then now let's get into a bit of fishing. Have a good one. Oh, I'm stuck in the grass. Yeah, top order hasn't been going really good. Um, might switch it up a bit, just wanna give it a few more costs. Because, uh, yeah, I haven't fished this pond ever. And one of the local guys said they was actually perching here, so that would also be pretty cool, but I don't think I'm gonna pick up a perch on top water. But uh, if I can hook up with a big old largey on the popper, it'll be pretty, pretty nice. I must say I'm pretty excited for today because we got a lot planned out. Uh, we're only gonna be fishing until like 12, but um, it's gonna be packed, so hopefully I can make a good video for you guys. I have literally tried everything. I've been throwing cranks, I've thrown weightless, I've thrown weighted, I've thrown different colors and I just can't seem to catch a fish. And I heard there's some perch as well and I really want to catch a perch as well. I've even thrown a little inline spinner. Uh, just nothing is just seeming to work right now. But this place, place looks really, really good. We only have like a few minutes left and then we're going to head over to the next spot. Hopefully we can catch something there. Um, because I really don't want to blank today. That will just be terrible. I mean, the weather was pretty bad the couple, the last past couple of days, but still, um, if I don't catch one in this video, I'll probably make a part two where I am actually catching one. But I really, gonna, I'm going to try my best and catch a nice little bass for you guys. Okay, so stay tuned. Thank you. 
come through the palisade there and then next minute they are coming. Right. Come on. Decent little bass, guys. Broke the ice. Second cast at the new spot. But this wind is terrible. I hope you guys can hear me. There we go. Too big for the fish tank, but uh, I'll take it. <laughs> awesome. Welcome back guys. Okay, so we just finished at Florida Dam in South Africa. Uh, only caught one fish. It was caught on a black grub with a mojo rigged and a medium, a medium to slow retrieve with a few jigs here and there. Everyone in South Africa, I encourage you guys to go and fish that dam. It's really nice. Um, some good lily pads, good structure, good cover. And I really do encourage you guys to go fish there. Right now we are on our way back to Impala Park Dam in, in Gauteng in South Africa as well. And we're gonna try and catch the small bass for in my fish tank. So hopefully we can get that done. Um, so yeah, enjoy the rest of the ride with us. I'm gonna show you guys a quick little B-roll of us on the road and then we're gonna get back to fishing. Enjoy. I do not know how this view is because I'm using my GoPro to vlog right now. Um, but we have come to the end of the fishing day. We only caught that little one, um, but we'll definitely do a part two of catching a small bass for the fish tank. So just stay tuned to that. It is definitely coming. Uh, it is on my bucket list. But yeah, I'm sorry this video was really short. We only caught one fish. The day was really tough. Uh, this is actually our third dam right now. We've, we went to this one first and now we went to this one they're like right across each other so yeah but we didn't get any luck just got snagged a bunch of times and um, yeah Ian almost lost his crankbait but anyway guys it was a fun day in total we, we explored some new ponds and stuff like that so I hope you guys enjoyed the video but please let me know if you guys enjoyed this and subscribe if you're new to the channel I would really appreciate it and stay tuned for the next video for part two see you guys in my next video cheers